Imagine just about any habitat in the ocean, from the tiny spaces between sand grains to the vast open waters, and you'll find scale worms living there. Of the nearly 20,000 species of segmented worms known today, nearly 10% are scale worms. What makes this group of worms so successful? Researchers at the Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Institute and the Smithsonian National Museum of Natural History are on the hunt to find out. They are using remotely operated vehicles to explore the ocean's uncharted habitats where these beautiful worms thrive. Scale worms are easily recognized by the fleshy scales covering their backs and the hundreds of dazzling bristles below them. Scale worms dominate the deep sea, not only in terms of species numbers, but also in the variety of their shapes and sizes. Despite this stunning diversity, for most deep sea species their mere existence, where they came from, and how they have adapted to survive in this challenging habitat, remain a mystery. Scale worms are predators, continually searching the sea floor for their next meal. Interestingly, many deep sea species are blind and rely on long finger-like sensory appendages to help them locate their prey and to give them early warning of predators. Some scale worms have developed symbiotic relationships with other animals like corals, sponges, and even other types of worms. In some of these cases, the scale worms have relatively small sensory appendages. Presumably, they don't need early warning systems for this sheltered symbiotic lifestyle. This phenomenon was observed in two recently discovered scale worm species that live on deep sea acorn worms. Their lack of eyes and the tiny sensory appendages on their heads initially gave scientists the mistaken impression that their heads had been bitten off and were regenerating. On the other end of the spectrum, some scale worms have evolved to live in the vast midwater. The result? Extra long sensory appendages that may help these worms detect approaching predators and prey even earlier. This can mean the difference between life and death in a habitat where there is nowhere to hide. The extra long appendages in many swimming scale worms may also indirectly contribute to energy savings by helping them sink more slowly. Remarkably, this unusual scale worm has another buoyancy trick. It arches its scales to form a channel above its back, presumably increasing its surface area to keep itself afloat without swimming. Scale worms are a fascinating group of animals. Investigating their diverse forms and behaviors reveals the many ways this particular group of segmented worms has been able to thrive in so many challenging habitats, including the deep sea.